right, guys. So, I'm back after those long two weeks of uploading every day. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It was a lot. Uh, very excited that it's over. I think I might change my upload schedule. What my schedule was is like every three days I would upload. So I'd upload a day and then two days would go by and then I'd upload again. I might do Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday just because a lot of people do Monday, Wednesday, Friday. I think that's what I might do. Maybe like, okay, so I think what I'm going to do is Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, 2 p.m. Easter. We could try that. Um, I was uploading at noon, but it seems like people weren't really watching it until around 2 p.m. So I might just upload a little bit later so when it comes out, people are watching it as it's out. I think that's what I might do. But anyway, today I wanted to talk about some books that I got, and they're very exciting. It's Monster High and Ever After High. So um, I have been reading the Monster High original books. I had this boxed set and there's only three in here right now because I'm reading book four. I don't know why it's taking me so long to read book four but it is. Um, these books it took me like a day to read each one but book four is taking me forever. I've been reading it for like a week and I still haven't finished so I'm hoping I finish that in the next few days. Um, but I bought this whole set and it's the original um, Monster High young adult fiction series. It's awesome. I really, really enjoy it. Um, it's definitely young adult. It's not kids books like these that I'm going to show you are. So I do really like that. It is literally 82 degrees right now in this house. <laughs> um, I think my car said it was like 95 degrees outside. It is so hot today. So I got the fan and the AC blowing. It is too freaking hot today. Let's get started. So I'm just going to start with this one here. This is the Monster High Diaries, Jackie Laura and the new Step Momster. I think that's adorable. I actually got this from Dollar Tree. So it was a dollar. Um, they had the boxed set on Amazon. I saw that later. And it's like five, I think. There's five of them. It's like the whole Monster High Diaries together but this was the only one that I saw at Dollar Tree so I just picked it up. It's definitely like more of a kids book than the Monster High books are. I love Monster High stuff so I figured I'd try it. It's a dollar. If I don't like it, whatever. The Cool Ghouls Complete Boxed Set Monster High. I think they're hardcover. I'm not actually sure. They look like they're hardcover and there's four and they're the Ghoul Friends books. So there's, what's number one? So it's Ghoul Friends Forever, Ghoul Friends Just Wanna Have Fun, Ghoul Friends Who's That Ghoul Friend, and Ghoul Friends Till the End. And these are pretty big books, but this was brand new and it was with Prime Shipping and it was like eight bucks. That's crazy. And the original price is $52 and I got this for like eight fifty or something like that. Crazy, crazy. So that's awesome, and it's all sealed up and everything. Still has the plastic wrap on top. The next one I got is Ever After High, a school story collection. And this is Next Top Villain, Kiss and Spell, and Semi Charming Kind of Life. These are adorable. I also love Ever After High. I definitely like Monster High better, but I also really enjoy Ever After High. So I love the way they look. And this is, again big font kids book but I like kids books so I don't really care and it's so cute because on the side it says after, ever after high they look like the same thing so, I don't know if they're made by the same yeah they're made but they're everything's made by Mattel so maybe that's why it all looks like the same stuff but I don't really care and the final one is Ever After High, the Storybook of Legends. So this is Storybook of Legends, Unfairest of Them All, and A Wonderland Full World. And this was also like, I don't know, eight bucks. All of these were around eight dollars. And this said it was like new, so I figured it was read before. It's in the plastic wrap too. It's literally never been opened. 
This is new condition. This isn't like new condition. That's shocking. $45 is the original price for three of these books. This one, $42. That's crazy. And I got them for like $8. So very, very cool. I'm very glad this stuff is on Amazon. I'm going to go ahead and open this up and look at these books because these books look pretty big. Let me see what they look like. Okay, so they look like all the others. It, it still looks like a kid's book. It's so pretty though, the way they mark the pages and stuff. Cool. Very pretty. None of the Ever After High have any actual like hardcover sleeve. Same with this one. It's just hardcover. But the ones in this boxed set do have a sleeve to them, so interesting. I don't know why they did that. Is that like a new thing? I don't know. There's nothing better than like taking the plastic off of new books. Oh my god. These are like squeezed in there. No, these don't have sleeves on it either. How weird. So it's a hardcover book. It's just printed right on the, the book. Pretty artwork. So let me see what they look like on the inside. Oh, okay. This one popped right over to a page with a picture in it. Yeah, these have pictures in it. Interesting. And big font. It doesn't say what the age group is. I'm guessing 9 to 12. I'm guessing these are all just middle grade fiction. I would even say like 7 to 12 because it's big words or big, big letters and lots of pictures. Lots of pictures. Interesting. But they look like they'd be pretty quick reads. But Monster High, the original books are like, these are straight up, you know, uh, young adult fiction. So, but I'm excited to read all of these. I have 11 new books right here to read. So very exciting. Um, I, yay, I did 8,000 steps today. Okay. Um, yeah, I've, I'm really excited to read these. I love these little um, kids books and stuff and I love Ever After High and I love Monster High. I love the books. I love the movies. I think the movies are super cute. I don't own any of the dolls or anything. I know that the Monster High, they have these little blind bags and then their little figurines. Those are super cute. I definitely need to pick out a couple of those because they're so adorable. And I think I saw on um, Five Below's website that they have them for a dollar each. So if you guys have a Five Below near you and you were looking for some of them, I would check there. They do have a lot of blind bags. I've gotten a Pick Me Pop from there before for five dollars and then they were eight dollars at Books A Million. So pretty awesome if you have one near you. I definitely want to go soon. I haven't been since around Christmas time and everything was a mess. Everything was picked over. Everything was like thrown everywhere. It's like, I don't know what it is about the holidays, but people just do not care and they just throw things. Like, you don't have to throw things in the store. You could just, you know, move things around and pick up what you want and then put back what you don't want. Don't have to just like freak out and throw everything. I don't get it. I'm thinking this week I'm going to do like a haul week. So Tuesday, Thursday, Sunday, I would film a haul and upload it. I think that would be fun. So if that sounds good to you, stay for the week. If you ever read any of these books, let me know what you think. Um, if you prefer Ever After High or Monster High, let me know. I prefer Monster High, but they're both very cute and I love both of their movies and I love their world. I really wish this kind of stuff was around when I was a kid. Um, Monster High original books were like 2011, I think is when they came out. So that was kind of my time, I guess. But all of this stuff is pretty new. And I would have loved to have stuff like this when I was a kid. So I'm still loving it, even though I'm an adult. I don't care. I'm reading it all. So thank you for watching, and I will see you on Thursday. Bye.